Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Cindy Marie. We are doing a new tiny tidy today. I have not completed the dividers in my junk drawer where I did the knives. And then I also want to clean my three tier shelf that's in my bathroom. So let me turn you around and show you. So I don't know, a month or so ago, I got this thing that is now collecting dust on top. I pulled out all the utensils. So we're gonna put it into here, and then this is the three tier um, shelf thing that I'm using. And you can see like in between, there's dust. So I wanna take that all out. I still wish I had like organizers for this thing, just because I just feel like it's all just all over the place and then there's, there's dust on the bottom. So before we get into it, um, this is an open collaboration hosted by Sunday Dawn from The Helpful Home. So please make sure that you go in my description and click on the playlist of um, awesome ladies that join in. Sometimes we have the usual suspects, sometimes we have new. There's at least 10 different videos you can watch to give you some motivation. And let's get started. So I haven't even opened it. I don't even know how to do it. I figured we would figure this out together. Of course, I'm nervous because, well, that's just the way I am. Holy crap, that scared the crap out of me. Oh. I'm glad I caught that on camera, eh? I think it did warn me too. Where did it say that? Oh, right here. Caution. Spring under. Okay, it's not. Use caution when removing the seal. <laughs> you think? Okay. Oh, got it. Okay, cool. Do we think that's big enough? I'm probably not gonna put three in there, but I mean, I am probably putting three. No, probably just two. Yeah, okay, <laughs> that was easy, guys. Okay, might be a little crooked. Oop, ah, there we go. Okay, cool, cool. I think what I'm gonna do Okay, I'm trying to put you in a good angle here. Okay, I think, first off, when I went through this, I said I didn't want that, but since I got rid of all my lemon stuff, I actually am going to declutter that. It's in perfect condition. I think I used it like twice, so good willing that. This one is used for salads, I'm still keeping. This one has a mind of its own. I'm, I'm gonna clean that. And I'm thinking I'm just gonna, no, I'm just gonna recycle it. Why would I clean it, right? Okay. This sucker still has to go on the top side because it's just so big. My husband uses this knife very often, so I definitely wanna keep that here. And I think I definitely wanna put the scissors here. Um, these really don't work either. Cause I feel like No, I can't get rid of them. Cuteness wins. Okay. All right, maybe if I put it like that. Okay. So I think I'm gonna keep the tongy guys in here. Let's stick all the tongs together. So, you know, I don't use this very often still, so. Let's see if I actually can slip it up there. There we go. Okay, again, I can't get rid of it because it's just so cute, but I think I might put him with no, it's going to go back there too. Um, okay. These are for my mixer, which I don't use very often. Um, I use this for like gravies and stuff like that, but I'm going to put them with them back there. Let's put that back there again. 
My son uses the apple cutter very often. So I'm actually gonna stick that here. I'll close those right now. Okay, my little scoopers, cause they're adorable. Maybe I can just put that actually here, like up there. Okay, get rid of that. Okay, I'm gonna put that there. And I just have this guy, which I can put there. And the trouble with these is that, like, I think we just have a lot of chip bags right now, but I'm just kind of going to stuff them. I really don't like this. Now I feel like there's no room. I don't use these that often, though. I'm going to put that up here. Hmm. I do use this often, but... Yeah, that'd be fine just like that, right? It's not like he uses the knife that often, but yeah, and then we still got room. Okay, I actually like that. So, recycling these, and I'm goodwilling those, okay? So that's taken care of, and then I have two left over. Um, I don't know where I'm gonna use them, but I'm definitely gonna keep them, obviously. Yeah, those things really sprung out. Okay. So that took no time. Um, I'm going to get my vacuum. We're going to pull everything out of that three shelf tier. I don't know what it's called. Caddy? Three shelf kit? I don't know. We're going to, we're going to, we're going to work on it. It's actually super hard to vacuum in there, so I'm just gonna have to, you know, do the old fashioned way and clean it out. So on the table here is the things that were in this. Um, as you can see, I do not straighten my hair often. That's full of dust. This is just a wet paper towel. So I'm just gonna, I think I'm actually gonna straighten my hair tomorrow, but tomorrow I'm going to DeKalb with my daughter. I've already mentioned that in my previous video. Obviously this video is gonna come out after my grocery hauls, but that's okay. All right, so we're just gonna wrap this back up, put it in the bottom. Okay, I gotta, for some reason there was a screwdriver in there. I'll just put that in my junk drawer. These, this is garbage. All right, so this is where our toilet paper goes, the extras, and the flushable light, wipes, not wipes. Okay, move you over a little bit. Okay, this is from Christmas. So I think I'm gonna throw away the top layer. And um, it was actually under everything, but um, these are just for, you know, when guest towels or whatever they're called. So I'm just gonna put them in a baggie with the rest of them that I have. I don't even know how it got here. All right, so this is where this organization thing comes into play. I feel like I need like two small organizers in this thing just because like the toothpaste is in there <sighs> i'm gonna go look really quickly at my house and see if i can find something whoa <laughs> whoops okay so this is what i found apparently we use this for like i'm assuming the kids craft stuff when they're older younger sorry so i think this is like the perfect thing i know it doesn't match with my bathroom but that's okay so here, toothpaste, and I keep hitting the camera, not meaning to. Look at that. 
it won't fall over now. Okay. Well, this is almost out. So I actually want to make note of that. I need dry shampoo. Okay. Some spray spray stuff, you know. Um, mousse I don't use very often. Hairspray is getting low. This is my professional foot stuff, but it's icky now because I've had it a while, so I'm just going to toss it. Um, I have really bad cracked heels. Not anymore, actually. I went to a podiatrist um, because I'm diabetic and stuff. You know, you have to make sure you, you know, you take care of your feet. And so um, once I got control of it from him, I got something that like razors off your dead skin or whatever and now my heels you would never even known I had issues with it like years ago anyways this is I think my daughter's I'm just gonna keep that and that's her lotion as well and then this is mine and my nine-year-old's deodorant so I'm just gonna keep that right in here and then we have a little space but this is the stuff that was always falling and honestly I think the deodorants fall too I mean technically I could just I could just keep it in there with that so there we go guys okay guys there you have it there's my tiny tidy um I wanted to do something different I almost filmed cleaning my second bathroom but I'm like I've done that before so um I wanted to get those dividers done and I wanted to clean this tier thing once I clean my bathroom so there you go some quick inspiration for you to just sometimes you just have to do those little things that you forget to do and do it. So there you go. I hope you guys have a good week. Um, please make sure to check the playlist for the other fabulous ladies who have joined in this week. And I will see you in the next video. Bye guys.